Paul Newman. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make a line graph in Google Sheets with the new graph and chart tool that they have as of 2019. So go ahead and start by highlighting what it is that you want to turn into a graph. You can either left click and drag to highlight everything that you want to graph out, or you can Start in the first cell, like A1, hold down the shift key, and then touch the last. Once you've done that, you press insert, part. Usually it defaults to a line graph. Now, in this case, I had, for this little experiment, minutes and then the temperature with foil and with a control. So I would want two lines of results, but what I'm seeing in the default here for this chart is three lines. So one of them is something that I don't want. You can even see here in blue, they tell you minutes. So minutes should be the, the x-axis, not, not one of the lines. So what you do is over here in the editor, you go to series. The series are the lines that are being displayed on the graph. So we get rid of right click on that, actually left click, and press remove. That gets rid of the minutes, leaving us just the foil and the control, which is exactly what we want. Now, to get the minutes down here where they belong on the x-axis, now we go to add an x-axis. The data range will be the column A, so from A1 to A12, with a colon in between. So A1, colon, a12, and there we go. Now we've got the minutes down there on the bottom. Now this would be temperature, this would be minutes. So now we need to add our, our labels for the X and the Y, or the horizontal and the vertical axes. So you can do that by right-clicking, or by going to Customize up here. I find right-clicking a little easier, so right-click and go Chart Titles. Horizontal axis title will be minutes. You don't even have to press, well, you do press enter, but you don't have to press save. It immediately shows right there. And I'll right click again and get my vertical axis. I'll call that temperature. And Celsius. And there it is. And then to customize the to customize the title, you can just double click on the title, or you can also go through the customize over here as well. And once you put your title, in a, in a title for a graph like this, you would actually want to have a description clear enough so that when someone looks at this, they know what they see in the data. So this one might say, like, temperature of different beakers wrapped with different materials over a period of 20 minutes. And that's it. So that's how you make a double line graph with the new Google Sheets chart editor. I hope that was helpful.